Welcome to our video on invalid value errors. In this short tutorial, we will explain to you how to solve errors 8560-8058-90097-8105, commonly known as invalid value errors. Let's start. Errors 8560-8058-90097 and 8105 occur because of invalid values placed as inputs in the listing workflow. More specifically, the error occurs when you provide an invalid value for the specified field name in your inventory file template. How to solve it? It depends on whether you see it when adding products either via bulk upload or single upload. Using bulk upload, make sure that your product ID is correct, hence check character requirements. For example, UPCs have 12 digits, EANs have 13 digits, and ISBNs have 10. To resolve this error, resubmit your product data with a valid value in the specified field. To determine the valid values, see the Valid Values tab in the template that you used to upload your inventory. It is possible that the product you are trying to list already exists in the broader Amazon inventory, but is classified in a different category than the category template you are using to list the product. Each category has its own template because products in different categories require different details. Please ensure you are using the correct category template for this offer. You can download category specific template from Inventory File Templates help page. The steps are a bit different in case you are using the single listing process. To solve it as a first step, log in to your Seller Central account. Then simply go to Menu by clicking at the top left hand side and then click Inventory and Manage All Inventory. In order to access your inventory page, at the top of the page, click on Complete with Issues, search Suppressed and Inactive Listings, Invalid Information. In this page, you can see all SKUs that are currently invalid. Here, just provide the correct values when you see flagged as invalid, then click on Save in order to solve the invalid value error. Overall, we observed that one of the main causes of these errors is copying pasting over the predefined list of valid values for an attribute. Hence, it is very important that you follow our best practices while you list your products, like choosing values only from our predefined lists of values. This way, you will not even need to troubleshoot. So, this concludes our video on invalid value errors. Thanks for watching.